guys, it's Nana. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be reacting to Arlequino teaser and animated short. It has came out yesterday, I believe, and a lot of people have been excited for it because Arlequino is coming in a few days. Apparently there is a bunch of lore in those trailers and I am very excited to jump into it and watch it with you guys. So yeah, without further ado, let's watch it together. All right, we're starting with the song Burning in the Embers, which is the animated short. It's seven minutes long and we'll see how it goes. I have no idea what to expect, honestly. The teasers and animated shorts for Genshin and Honkai Star Rail get better and better with time, so... You were born into this world all alone. But here in the house of the hearth, you will grow up to be strong. Your goal is to learn, to compete, to defeat all your brothers and sisters in battle, and become king. That does not seem like a good thing, honestly. Where's Pear Ware? Didn't she want to hear the story? Who's that? Excuse me, mother. She's doing a funeral for her spider. That child. Maybe her curse is flaring up again. Clairvy, see to her. Is that Arlequino? Oh, okay. Her name is Perwer? You you want some? Oh, it's so sure. cute. Uh, oh, she's leaving for the spider. Spiders don't eat cake. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, the music. The music is so pretty. She even made a little bowl. Usually argue with their daughters. I heard that in Snezhnaya, colored light dances in the sky at night. When we are grown up, shall we go see it together? <laughs> It was a sudden change. He will be a great king. Oh, why has she done that? Was it she that killed her or did the other girl just do it so she could win? I should have pruned this flower long ago, not waited till it wilts. How grotesque. Wouldn't you agree? Damn. Innocence and kindness are such beautiful qualities. Who is that lady? Is she a Fatui as well? Or was a Fatui? She's pretty cool, not gonna lie. Although very evil from what it seems. She's really pretty. A bird tied down will never fly the nest. You are no exception. The music is always fantastic. Surrender. Let your 
mother guide you, and you shall become the one true king! You don't seem to be a good guide, girl. I guess that was the moment that her powers awakened. destroyed the whole building oh was she sent to jail oh so the other lady was a harbinger so she was probably the old knife the one that is like supposed to be like very cruel hmm her Majesty the Tsaritsa has decreed Oh, it's Shnezaya. I hereby pardon your crimes and bestow upon you a hey, new Hey, that's wonder. <laughs> this title and its legacy of bloodshed are now yours to bear. My poor, mad, cursed knave. She was very young when she became the knave, huh? that kid come with me I will raise you as my child like a strict and unfeeling father oh so that's how she became father maybe she didn't want to be mother because the other mother was terrible huh that is very interesting. Who is that child, though? I guess we won't know until we do her story quest, or maybe not even then. That's pretty interesting. We got a, a little bit of a glimpse on Shnejnaya, too. I think it was since that other animated short about Signora, like Signora's death, that they didn't have any visuals of Shnejnaya. Shne God, that is so hard to say. But yeah... Wonder being there as well is pretty cool. I really like seeing him in his Harbinger era. But yeah, interesting. She ended up killing the old knave and becoming the one now. I wonder if she's as cruel as the old knave because there's like a lot of very confusing things about word quests that talk about the knave so it's kind of difficult to know if they are talking about the old knave or the current knave um, because they mentioned something about Inazuma like there's an Inazuma quest and also a Sumeru quest which they have some mentions of the knave and Arlecchino so it's kind of like difficult to know if she is actually extremely evil, like the old knave, or if she is just, you know, putting on a facade. Maybe the traumas of her past have made her evil, uh, which would be very plausible because that's the same situation with Wanderer. And I think most Harbingers, I guess. But yeah, let's watch the teaser as well. Now, I almost said trailer, but it says here, character teaser. Arlecchino is sleeping peace. I'm sorry. Father. Who is that? I was reckless. When I saw those emaciated patients, those poor children, the futile hope in their eyes. I've told you before, recklessness always leads to failure. She has an amazing but voice. But it was not wholly in vain. I shall settle the rest. Oh. Philanthropist and savior ah, of the poor. Those fools. They will never know the wonders of wealth. Is that the one that Lynette mentions huh? in her... In the Archon Quest, in the Act 1? Uh, uh, <laughs> 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 Well, 
She killed him with her shoe. Let me just say I love the fact that she's wearing pants. <gasps> Father. Oh, Fremene. Face. Fremene, we can take in a few more homeless children next year. I have acquired some new funds. Oh. Okay. That was probably not Lynette's... Um, the person that Lynette mentioned in her quest, then. Mission accomplished. You can sleep now. Thank you. Once I'm better, I'll start my next mission. I think you're not starting anything. Since candles ripping up profits under the guise of fun, his immense wealth has vanished. Those who parade their virtues often do the most evil. We are not like them. Rest in peace, Snajevna. Someone from Snajnaya? That she took care of? Oh. I see. That is very interesting. I'm still intrigued who is that child from the animated short. That was very, very good. Like, I think as time goes by, Genshin gets way better with the teasers and like animated shorts. It's pretty interesting because I think the only characters that have an animated short about them are Shell and Ayaka. And this one definitely gives a, a big glimpse on... Arlequino's past. Apparently her name is Peru. I don't know how to say her name. I am so sorry. But yeah, what do you guys think of these trailers? Did you guys enjoy it? Are you guys excited? More importantly, are you guys pulling for her? I still am not very convinced <laughs> about pulling for her because I want Alhaitan and Navia and I have a feeling that if I pull for someone else, I will not get both of them because my luck is terrible and I am on a guarantee <laughs> so I am not really sure it would be cool to have Arlequino for collection purposes since she has a very cool design I especially like her battle form which I've heard some people did not really like her boss form but I personally really really enjoy it I think it just looks very classy and I like it's a little more than her normal outfit, but I really like her normal outfit as well. The fact that she's wearing pants, which is a little bit of a difference in, you know, uh, design <laughs> since they usually have the girls wearing like skirts and like shorts and stuff like that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching the animated short and the teaser with me and I'll see you guys next time. Her banner is coming soon. I will be doing some pulls and I will also be doing some exploration. Um, unfortunately, cannot do her story quest soon because I have not finished the Arkham quest um, for Fontaine. I'm still in Act 2. I'll get there eventually and I'll probably meet her in the Arkham quest one day. <laughs> we'll see. But thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.